warmer days. This is the biggest burger that we offer at QVC. This is Kansas City State Company. You're getting six or 12 eight ounce colossal steak burgers. Let's discuss. So they're rich in flavor. They have an incredibly heavenly bite. Since 1932, I mean, the dedication to delicious steak began many, many years ago. And this is the Customer Choice Food Award past winner a couple times over for best burger. So this is where you want to go. You can choose six, which is five easy pay, or excuse me, is a uh, is it on five? No, it's on four. Four easy payments of fifteen twenty-five, and then we have a twelve count on four easy payments of twenty-four twenty-five. Now, the reason I I pause there is because you can stock up and save twenty-five dollars when you pick up that twelve count and get it home. If you get the six count, you have a choice of cheddar bacon, which we have three hundred remaining, or your choice of classic, which is that just original burger heavenly flavor, and we've only got 200 there. Now, in that 12 count, we only have the combo choice left, and we only have 200. So if you want to stock up and save, you got to do it quickly. Now, Ralph Pallarino is joining us in In the Kitchen with Mary today, and he's a dear friend of the show, but he also is a train chef, former restaurateur, and my <laughs> friend, it is good to see you. How's it going today? Uh, it's great. I'm surrounded by burgers and... I love that we're so close to spring and we're talking about burgers yes. because a lot of times we kind of hesitate with the burgers, right? But I love how QVC is hearing the foodies and saying, we want the burgers now. We want to stock up. We want to get this going. And these eight ounces, Mary, so exciting, Huge. right? That big burger. Yeah. That's a two-hander. Yeah, look. this is a, By the way, I'll start out with this is how they come, okay? So you can see that. Uh, and by the way, when you cook these, they actually get a little bit bigger, which is crazy, just like our hot dogs. So this is how they come, eight ounces, right? Nicely fit in that freezer. And this is a steak burger. So I always like to say, let's go to the board and see what I'm talking about. This is, look at it. First of all, I'm, before I even cut into it, I can't even contain the juices, Mary, because, <laughs> uh, because this is a steak burger, right? So what does that mean? That means that we've taken all our wonderful cuts of meat, whether it's prime rib, whether it's filet mignon, strip steak, and we put them inside this burger, right? And this is what you get. You get this heavenly, juicy burger. Now, why is it so juicy? Is because all the marbling of all that corn-fed meat, right? And then what we do something is our technology when you form a burger, right, the one thing you want to be careful with is not pressing it too, uh, too hard because then you come up with what's called a hockey puck, right? Got it. So our technology just kind of gently presses these together and creates these flavor pockets, right? Now, they're important because they have all the flavor, and when you bite into this, it gives a crumbling effect, right? right. So when you bite a good burger, you want it to be juicy, and you want it to crumble in your mouth, just fall apart in your mouth. And that's what you get from this classic. Okay. Now, this is the classic. You're burger. killing us. Um, uh, I, <laughs> the, the I know, I got lost. Sorry, yeah, I, I forgot. The, are so. you kidding? That we're, <sighs> we're passing out because we want a burger so bad. Um, now, the, to describe the difference between the classic and the cheddar bacon. Sure. All right, so you saw the classic. I'm going to okay. move him over a little bit over here. Okay. And then, let me just get that shot. Okay, now, this is that uh, cheddar bacon. You can see that Wisconsin cheddar almost kind of like oozing off of the top before I even cut it. And then we have a smoke, uh, applewood smoked bacon that inside. So what I love about this burger, right, wow. is A, you have, <laughs> you have two condiments already in the burger. So now you don't have to worry about cheese or bacon because they're in the burger. And what I also love about this is that that bacon, Mary, adds a little dimension of fat, right? Yeah. Fat equals flavor. So now as you're cooking these, they're basting with the cheese. You get the creaminess and the bacon. Yeah, blah, blah, yeah. just like that. Wiping yeah. the chin. Um, you know what? Yeah. Now, a lot of folks, the, mo the majority of the folks that are placing the order right now are picking up the combo and the 12 count. I also want to highlight okay. that we have auto delivery available today. Auto delivery, you can lock it in every 60 days for one year. Um, and remember, you're getting the six count or the 12 count. Now, in that 12 count, we only have the combo choice left, but... 
do not wait. There are now fewer than 200 remaining and you stock up and save $25 on that 12 count choice. Now in that six count, you can pick up the classic right. and you can also pick right up now. the cheddar bacon, but customer choice food award pass winner for best burger first day presented this year. They are just now back in stock. And I mean, these are Big Ralph. So, like, if I wanted to have one on a hungry day, I could. But if I wanted to split one, that's absolutely possible with these sizes, too. Yeah. So, let's talk about that for a second. So, they come frozen. Okay. You want to cook these from frozen. Make your life easy, right? Cook from frozen. Now, if you want to share these, here's a tip defrost these, take them out of the package, cut them in half, and form like two balls, right? Now, you're ready for two. Uh, nice size smash burgers. So that's the best way to split these, unless you just want to make a burger, split it down the middle, and give it to your friend. Now, yeah. Mary, Mary, hit it. Start the season. I got it. I got to give Mary her own burger <laughs> as we get into this busy season, so I don't forget. So I have the classic burger with a little bit of cheese on there. Okay, it's on the bottom and it's on the top. Now, Mary, I'm going to go in with some chili. Okay. Oh. Oh, boy. Here we go. It's a little chili on there, okay? Then I'm going to go a little bit more cheese. I'm going to hit it with mustard, okay? A little bit of mustard. And now I'm going to go in with um, a little bit of onion, Mary, okay? Yep. Just like that, okay? Then I am going to put the top on. Now I'm going to cut this, Mary, and we're going to see what it looks like inside, okay? This is the Mary D Burger 2023. Let's get a nice cut on that. Are we ready? Okay. Hello. Okay. There's the burger. There's the Mary burger. Okay. You know what? There is way too much happening in this face to be able to control it right now. I really did have to pause because the, the drool was imminent. That looks so good. It is huge. That looks like a burger that I would get in a fussy restaurant and pay way over the top money for. Look at that. I mean, that's a well, big, uh, thick, thick, juicy burger. I mean, I could grill them, right? Can I, before it gets warm out, can I cook them in the air fryer? Yes. Well, yeah. Now, the okay. air fryer, it's going to be messy, but that's okay so because, good. yeah, listen, first of all, you, I want to go back a step. You said something about this being on like a high-end restaurant menu yeah. or a nice pub. We, we sell these to those because the chefs come to us and they love our blend because this is like, you know, a burger is like a recipe, just enough fat, and then you have all those steak cuts that go together, that makes the best burger. So it's really the blend. And by the way, I mean, the size is everything. I mean, this is definitely your dinner burger uh, times 100. This is a great burger. And I think people you know, love burgers uh, at QVC from Kansas City Steak Company because they rely on them being good, right? I mean, you want something that you know is gonna be good. And that's important. I agree. I agree. And now I know, Ralph, we have a full hour with you at 3 p.m. Eastern time right here on QVC2. I hope that you have enough left for a full presentation, my friend. I, well, I, I don't know. I mean, you tell me. I mean, I, I have them ready, right? <laughs> I, I don't want to go into my, you know, my beauties here, but I do have 12. This is what it looks like, by the way, if you want to take a shot of that. Excellent. These are the 12, the six or 12. So I do have some extra just in case. Thank you. See how nice that looks? I know they look lovely. You look all party ready. Like um, <laughs> Ralph, thank you for being in In the Kitchen with Mary today. We'll make sure to tune in at 3 o'clock. All right. See everybody. Thank you. Bye-bye for now. Um, hey, at 3 p.m. Eastern time, you can catch a full hour with Kansas City State Company and Nancy Yoon coming up to talk to you about great foods for the spring. Hey,